Good morning and welcome to day 13 of 365 Days of Stories with Theo Mayer. I was telling the story of the Ching Man and remember how the stone cutter who when he dealt blows to the rock the sound it made was Ching every time. He had wished to be the Raja when he saw the Raja passed and somehow or another he ended up the Raja. But then his garden started to wither away and he realized that the sun was more powerful than he was. And so he sat on his bed one night and with such intensity, just as he had that day when he sat on his bed as the stone cutter wishing to be the Raja, he wished to be the sun. And he lay down in his bed. And when he awakened, he had a completely new form. He was the sun. He felt incredibly powerful. Such energy just emanating from him in all directions. And with that power, he just felt like wielding it. You can imagine being able to wield such energy as the sun. And with that, he looked down upon the earth, he even saw the gardens that had once been the Rajas, which were basically burnt to a crisp, looking like nothing that was worth salvaging. He started to just intensify his rays. Wherever there was water, wherever there was green things growing, he began to just scorch the landscape as best he could with his heat and his energy, seeing that his power was unlimited. Crop after crop was wasted forests lost their leaves and began to wither. A great spirit arose and realized that this could not go on. And as it did, it brought in stormy clouds, dark and gray, which began to cover the landscape that the sun was attempting to scorch. And as these deep, dark clouds came in over the landscape, the sun had no more power, no more power to burn it. And as it did, it intensified its rays, trying even harder to burn the clouds away and regain its power over the landscape. But those clouds had been bringing with them the life-giving rains and the landscape soaked in that moisture. Everything began to grow again. Seeds which had laid dormant in the soil began to sprout and grow. The sun grew incredibly frustrated and realized at a certain point there was not going to be much of a way that it could burn through these clouds. In fact, the more that it intensified its energy and heat, the more moisture was brought back up into the atmosphere to be dispersed again as rain over the landscape. The sun's intensified rays only increase that cycle of rain, flow, evaporation, and rain again. But he wasn't thinking about that. He was thinking about his power. 
and how it seemed to him as he beat his rays upon the landscape. There was an energy more powerful than he. And he began to think about that energy and wondered, in fact, how could he become that? And with that, we'll stop for today and continue again tomorrow with 365 Days of Stories with Theo Mayer. Thanks for joining. Have a good rest of your day.